Hey everyone, welcome back, and you know what it's time for, it's time to go, it's time to go to McDonald's to get a McBurger and french fries! No, I'm just kidding, it's the final Johto gym battle with Blue for the final badge. Blue, the gym leader of Viridian! Alright, so this is it. The final gym leader in Kanto. So Executor and Starmie and my Starmie's Ice Beam. And this is obviously not going to be good for my Starmie. Yeah, I know my Starmie's going to fall. Well, well, at least the gym leader in the game actually managed to, managed to take out my Pokemon first. But that's okay, because my Star Raptor should be able to manage to clean things up. Alright, so, one down. Both each have five Pokemon. Next is right on. Now for my Swampert! One Surf should be able to take it out! Blue's Pokemon can be tough, especially if you don't come in with the right Pokemon. If you want a challenge, like I do. And now for my Champ! Obviously, this is his second hardest Pokemon. Especially, because Machamp has really good attack power, especially too with his Dynamic Punch. Which not only does ma damage, but confuses, and it did major damage to my Swampert, and I'm gonna have to switch my Star Raptor to at least cut its attack power. Ah, and then he manages to get the dynamic punch on my Star Raptor. Ugh! That was frustrating. Wow, and it still did major damage even from that attack cut. It's okay, I've got a full restore. It was a good thing I used it too. It'll also cure me of confusion, which it didn't originally do that before in Gold, Silver, and Crystal. Alright, so I get a Brave Bird off. So I should be able to take out my champ. Yeah, my Star Raptor hangs on. Now for Gyarados. Now it's time for my Luxray to take charge. And if you're wondering why I use Charge Beam, it's also because... I want to have my special attack raised. I know a Thunderbolt would have taken it out in one hit, but... That's okay, I want to take advantage of the special attack. So that charge beam will finish it. And also, yes, raise my special attack again. Now for his Arcanine, probably his hardest Pokemon, especially because it has Flare Blitz, which it just used, and unfortunately it doesn't look like I'm going to get to use 
with special attack advantage. All right, now I've got my Swampert. And there it goes, the Flare Blitz again. Um, yes, Swampert hangs on, and now I'm gonna use, and it also gets burned, but I'm gonna use Swampert's most powerful attack and most powerful water type attack, Hydro Cannon. Hydro Cannon is like the moves like Hydro Cannon, Frenzy Plant, Blast Burn. That is like 150 base damage. But there are also attacks like Hyper Beam that you, that you, it's, that your Pokemon has to recharge. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my Swampert out of there. So my Rampardos is gonna be the finisher to this battle. As he's down to his final Pokemon, which is a Pidgeot. Alright. I use Head Smash, Rampardos' most powerful move. And this battle will end. But of course it will also take out my Rampardos in recoil damage. But that's okay. My Rampardos did a good job as well as my others, so that gives me all eight Kanto badges now, which gives me all 16. And you know what that means. So we get the Earth Badge. And now we can use the move Rock Climb outside of battle. Speaking of Rock Climb, now when we leave the gym, Professor Oak will call us. Now we just gotta get out of here. It shouldn't be just too tricky. I'm busy! Alright, out we go. And Professor Oak will call us. So we have to go there to pick something up from him. And so that is where we are going to be headed. I will heal my Pokemon right after. Alright, so back in Pallet Town, now we will head into the laboratory. And this is where you get the Rock Climb HM. You can, get your, you can also get your Kanto starter from here, but not until after you defeat Red. When you defeat Red, then you come back here and he will give you your Kanto starter, but of course you'll see that firsthand anyway for the second time because I also did it in Heart Gold, and now I'm going to be doing it on Soul Silver. So part number 90 is going to be going toward Mount Silver as the battle with Red inches closer, the final battle. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully comment, subscribe, and thumbs up. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time.